In question 16, we're told that Gemma has nine counters, each with a number one to nine on it. And we're told that she puts those counters in a bag and takes one out at random and doesn't replace it. And then she takes a second one. We need to work out in part A the probability that the number on each counter is even. So the probability that she gets an even um, and another even. So that means on the first one she gets an even. So in the first go, there is one, two, three, four evens out of nine. And then on the next go, she'll get one of the evens will be gone, and there'll be one less overall counter as well, of course. So then there'll be one, two, three evens, for example, out of eight. And because the middle term is and, it's the and rule, Therefore, we multiply that, and we get 12 over 72, and that cancels down to 1 over 6. The next part, part B, tells us to work out the probability that the number on the first counter added to the number on the second counter gives an odd number. The only way so that you're going to get an odd number from the two counters is thinking about it two evens don't make an odd and two odds added together make an even number we need to get an odd number the only way we're going to get that is if we get an oh, stick to black only way we're going to get that is if we get an odd and then a even or because the order doesn't really matter, an even and uh, an odd. So the probability of getting an odd and then an even, so the probability of getting an odd first is 5 out of 9, and remember we don't replace it, so then the probability get of getting an even, we've still got four evens there, but there's one less overall. And again, because it says or, we add the probabilities, here we said and, so we multiply them. The probability of getting an even is the same as in the first part of the question, 4 over 9. And then of getting an odd, well, we've still got 5 odds, but 1 less overall. That gives us 20 over 72. And we need to add that to 20 over 72, which gives us 40 over 72. And that, in fact, cancels down. So 8 goes into 40 five times, 8 goes into 72 nine times. Therefore, the probability is 5 over 9.